what, what brings you out? Why are you here? I'm here because the community needs to come together to make a difference in all these kinds of cases and um, the volunteers are an integral part of getting areas uh, not cleared but n knowing whether or not an area has been checked and we need we need boots on the ground ground pounders is what we call them um, and your thoughts about how the search has gone so far you have uh, anything that you can add to what we sort of know I mean how, how are you responding to what you're seeing out I am seeing a an excellent response honestly um, this has been pretty much immediate as soon as uh, it was known that she was missing as soon as she was reported. MPD as well as uh, the fire department has been out here for days and um, Maui Search and Rescue. Um, volunteers have been coming out. I, I This is the best possible uh, result that we could hope for is getting everybody out here um, this quickly and covering these areas. Um, for you personally, I, does this does this trigger anything? I mean, do feelings, emotions? Certainly, uh, yeah, but I, I and the people who I've worked with prior, um, some of them are family members. Um, basically, you just, you, you need to put that aside because we're here for Amanda and uh, that's what's important right now. What would you like the public to know at this stage of it? Uh, day three of a pretty hard search, four days missing. I think the public should know that um, soon the police department as well as the fire department will have to pull out um, unless something is found to keep them here and that means we're going to be even more reliant. The family will be very reliant upon volunteers and they have no intention of stopping the search. So that's gonna, we're going to continue to need volunteers and um, we would reference uh, everyone to the Facebook page, Find Amanda, um, for the, the most recent updates. We're going to need water. We're going to need food, sandwiches, snackable trail snacks. Um, those are the kind of things that are going to be necessary. And as the family realizes other things that are necessary, they will get posted. And that's... Honestly, that's the best that, that the community can be doing is just keep their eyes open. And I remember something that one of my daughters said um, while we were searching for Charlie. And uh, I, I, I don't know, I'm just thinking about it a lot right now. And that was, she told everyone, um, especially in this area, if you live abutted to this forest, if you're in this area, and even if you're not, get up and look all around your area. Just look, keep your eyes open. Um, but especially if you live in this area, go check your yard. You know, get at the highest point, look, check everything, every part of your yard. Um, we wanna leave no stone unturned.